we were to, we brought quality into the meeting and they said, well, we need to program the CMM. Uh, and usually we'll do that with an actual part. We'll take the first part off the line, take it over and program with it. Well, we wanted to skip a step. And so what we did is we decided, hey, we've already, through the programming of this part in Mastercan, we've already consumed this print, looked really closely at all the tolerances. We know the areas of concern, either because they're inspection points for the customer or because of how we're machining it. So let's go ahead and use uh, Mastercam, specifically Verisurf, to go through and program the CMM. And so it sits, Verisurf sits inside Mastercam, uh, and if we go through to inspect these, we just basically say, hey, create a toolpath, but instead of it being a cutter toolpath, it's a probe toolpath on the CMM. Uh, and this information will export to whatever CMM you have, and then that information is now ready to roll. We haven't built our first one yet, but we have our CMM uh, toolpaths. Now, one of the big benefits here is that not only do you have kind of a, a really easy to use environment to program this with, uh, but it's all coming from the same 3D model. So let's say that with this part, right, we've got uh, really thin features in here and we know this is gonna be a problem, right? We went to the engineer, we said to the customer, hey, this is, this is, this is not a good design, right? This is a problem area that we've identified. Now, if you come back to an engineer and you say, hey, uh, your design is wrong, right? The first reaction is going to be, uh, you're right. Uh, I humbly accept your feedback and will modify my model direct. Well, okay, maybe not. Uh, but it's hard to really tell somebody that they have a problem with their design uh, just by pointing at it. But with a 3D model, with an actual part here, you know, ahead of time, you can go and talk about it with the realistic model. This is probably one of those where they'll look at that and say, that's not my design. And then they'll really double check their 3D model and they'll make some updates. So when they do those updates, that's going to get you a new 3D model. You'll bring it into Mastercam and post with all the updated geometry, uh, the new machining geometry or the machining operations. But then it'll also be able to quickly post uh, the, the CMM code without any additional steps.